Hey everyone, it is Infamous Mango, and today I'm bringing you a Minecraft tutorial where I'll be showing you guys how to change your prefixes and suffixes on your Minecraft server. In other words, I'll be showing you guys how to add rank and group names and make them different colors and get it to work because I know a lot of people have trouble with this. So I'm going to make this as simple as I can. I have made a tutorial on this on my old channel, but that was about two years ago, so I thought, why not make an updated one? So just follow the instructions as best as you can and I'll do my best to answer your questions as well. So what you need to do is go to this link in the description. You're going to download Group Manager which is a part of Essentials but it's actually a different plugin. So you will need Group Manager download and that should download a zip file automatically and you will need Essentials Core Download. So I'm going to open that. That should take you to a different page. I'm going to click download and I should get a zip file. So you will need WinRAR or some sort of iCarver for this like 7-zip those are both free I'll put that in the description as well so I'm gonna drag these zip files to my desktop now what I'm gonna do is open up my server that I've already made if you need to know how I have tutorials for that as well so I'm gonna open up plugins I'm gonna open up my essentials zip file right here and really I recommend essentials for any server it's the number one plugin in my opinion and for managing a server so right now for the things we need we just need essentials chat.jar and essentials.jar everything else we don't need but you can put in if you want and then we're going to open up essentials group manager zip file and close that and we will drag in both of these files because we need essentials group bridge and essentials group manager now I want to point out one thing a lot of people always have trouble with group manager and they say the prefixes and suffixes don't add up or don't show up and that's the reason because they don't have a chat plugin so you need a chat plugin like essentials chat or iChat like there's a lot of chat plugins so you need a chat plugin for it to actually work so anyways we're gonna get started I'm gonna start my server up and for the first time with these plugins it should load and once it says successfully that means everything is working fine and up to date so done so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna log into my minecraft server and I'm gonna go into plugins and you'll notice that I have three new folders that came with this minecraft server so this is where all the config files are located so we're gonna look at that in a few seconds but first we're gonna go on my server and see how it looks like right now logging in and hopefully I don't get stuck in a block okay yes so now when I talk as you can see my name comes in yellow and that's different from the default of white so you know something has changed and yeah so I'm gonna show you guys how to change that and add a group name and colors we're gonna open a group manager right here we're gonna go to worlds and this is the only world I have right now so I'm gonna open it up I'm gonna open up groups and go to default because default is set to true that means anyone who joins who's not in a rank will be this rank right away so as you can see the prefix is just set to a color because at e is a color if I open up my color guide right here, this will be in the description as well. It says at E equals ye yellow, pardon me. So that means it is working because when I logged onto the server, my name was in yellow. So that's a good sign. So right now I want to edit owner because I am the owner. So what I'm going to do is put a square bracket, put owner because this is a typical prefix. And let's say I want it to be teal, I'm going to put at B. So the whole idea is that you put one of these codes before the item you want to change. So I'm going to save this and it should show up except I'm not in a rank. So I'm going to users, I'm going to go to make drizzle. And okay, I don't know what just happened. And make sure everything lines up otherwise this mod, not mod, this plugin will not work. And do not use the tab key, keep that in mind. So I'm going to write owner, I'm going to save it and now I'm gonna reload my world and there we go I have my group name and my player name in teal so it's as simple as that but let's say I don't want my player name to be teal what can I do I can open up the group file again and I can look down here I'm gonna open up my color codes and let's say I want my name to be in uh, let's say purple or pink whatever that color is after the last bracket I'm gonna put at D I'm gonna save it I'm gonna reload and everything works fine so it should be changed there we go so I have my name in pink or purple whatever that is and owner in teal let's say I want to change the brackets of the owner to be a different color 
so I want the brackets to be red what I'm gonna do is since you have to put a color code before the item you want to change I'm gonna make this right here a 4 and okay oops I hate when that happens but so I'm gonna put at 4 and then I am going to put right after the bracket because I want owner to be all in teal I'm gonna put at to B and then before the last bracket since I want the bracket to be the same color as the other one I'm gonna put at 4 so it's as simple as that and then right after will be at D so my name will be in purple so I'm gonna go reload on the server and everything's working fine there we go so I have brackets in red owner in teal and McDrizzle in pink or purple whatever that is now you can change each letter like that just put a color code before each letter and you can make it colorful do whatever you really want and the last thing if you want to add a suffix which is pretty pointless I don't think anyone uses it but I can make a suffix let's say um, I'll put it in this color McDrizzle the king um, save it I don't think people use suffixes they seem pretty stupid but there we go McDrizzle the king so that's how you basically enable everything pretty self-explanatory it's actually really simple than most people think and I'm gonna show you one last thing if you want to go more in depth in editing these kind of prefixes and suffixes. so if you go back to this main directory and go to essentials go to config.yml open up with notepad or wordpad whatever you have now scroll down till you see essentials chat wherever that is I cannot find it oh there we go so essentials.chat let me make this bigger now it's pretty self-explanatory but these hashes mean if one does not have a hash that means it's using that format so right now it's using this format display name and message and the reason is because we added prefixes directly in the group manager file but let's say you want to edit the files here you can do that as well so I can put a hash here so I don't want to use that and I can use this format so this format has a group right before so when I do this I will get a double group name and that's because I have edited two places where I want to group right so a lot of people have this problem so what you want to do is just keep it at default edit it in one place only and I'd recommend the first way I showed you because this way is just messes stuff up so I'm gonna add another hash and so this way right here the default way is the best way you want to go and edit in the group manager file if you want to go more in depth you can edit group formats over here and have specific formats so I'm not going to show you guys because you guys know how to do that right now and yeah so that's the tutorial it's easy as that and thanks for watching guys if you, I'll try to get back to you if you guys have any questions or anything and yeah peace Thanks for watching guys, please check out my other content, like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and please subscribe.